Kenny Bernstein's new Buick Funny Car definitely got the other racers' attention at last weekend's Super Bowl of drag racing at Firebird International Raceway. A lot of folks are debuting their new cars, only to look over and see Bernstein's make theirs aerodynamically obsolete. I think they pushed the rules to the limit, you know, we, we all try to do that, but I think they went a little beyond that. I'm not upset about it, I know a lot of people are, it's just going to uh, make us go back and do a little homework on our own car. No one seemed too concerned that the car was illegal, rather that it means Funny Car is in for some serious changes. Uh, we have to modify them enough just to get on our chassis and just to do the right job, but when we start getting as wild or that far out of it, uh, I think it will hurt the sport. Bernstein dominated the weekend, but ironically, he didn't win. He finally faced John Ford, and technology gave way. And I wondered how we were going to beat it. I kept looking at that lane. It, like you said, that million dollar in, in aerodynamics over there, and it scared me. And it was all I could do to stay in my own lane and put a little edge on him on the start line. And uh, my car stepped up and ran a little bit quicker, and, and he fell off. But while Force won this time, he is quick to admit his car is heading for the shot and for a few changes. In Phoenix, I'm Rick DeVore reporting for Speedway.